What's the most out of touch thing you've heard someone say? Aren't you a bit too old to have a grandma? A neighbor when I told her my grandma just passed away. You seem sad. My mother to my sister, at her husband's funeral. My dad who is now the director of accounting for the school district I teach for was talking about how my starting pay was way more than his starting pay. I said, well, yeah. The cost of living has increased a ton since then. This motherfucker straight up said no it hasn't. He started working there in 1992. This conversation happened in like 2017 about a year after I started working there. Again, he is the director of accounting. With a hefty storm approaching England, a politician advised those in its path that they should maybe leave, and go to their second or third homes, to be safe. When people were complaining about not being able to afford housing food living in general, one of the Dutch ministers I think he was a minister or at least the leader of a party said something along the line of well, find a rich boyfriend then. Ah, yes, that will solve the crisis. The wife of the business owner complaining to the employees about how she's underpaid for working there. She literally owns the building and her family make 300-500k profit a year all while underpaying the rest of the staff. I don't know why people get big mortgages. Just save up for a few months and pay cash for a starter home. Something like give a rich person $500 and they will invest into $1,000. Give it to a poor person and they will spend it in a week. Yeah exactly give it to someone whose needs are met and they can save, give it to someone who needs to eat pay rent etc they will spend it to survive. My boss once told me to have the maid drop my car at the shop. WTF. I was waxing a woman's eyebrows once and she was complaining that sometimes after she gets a massage the pillow leaves a circular indent on her face and she can't go out to lunch after. She then asked me if that ever happened to me. I was like mom I wax people for 11 bucks an hour I'm not going out to lunch lol, let alone getting massages. A guy in college was trying to find common ground with us when we were discussing how difficult it's been paying for college. I don't have college debt, but my parents are forcing me to only choose two new Apple product upgrades this year instead of three. People in the slums have the same chances and opportunities as everyone else, with absolutely no freaking clue how poverty crushes the soul. Co-worker you'll be able to buy a home once you get your inheritance. Me I won't have an inheritance, my family isn't well off. Co-worker of course you have an inheritance. Everyone's parents leave them an inheritance. I'm sure they're just keeping it a secret from you to surprise you. Said to me by my co-worker whose parents are both doctors, while my mom had recently been laid off and my dad was too sick to work. What do you mean you've never vacationed in the south of France? You won't be happier at work if we pay you more, but we need to figure out why workplace happiness is so low coming from a guy that made 10x what I did, and was born into old money. A police officer cannot commit a crime. Since crime requires premeditation, and police are charged with law enforcement, they cannot, by definition, premeditate to commit a crime. What a police officer does in the course of their job can never be considered criminal activity. This was the argument handed to me by our local police chief in response to my organization's police reform project. I was chatting with my boss about how I was worried my rent would go up a ton this year because all my friends' rents had, and how I wished house prices would drop just a little bit so I could actually buy something. Motherfucker looked me in the eyes and said wanting house prices to go down is socialism, we can't have that. My 74-year-old dad trying to help me with a budget how much do you think you need for food? $100 a month? That's probably plenty if you don't eat out. I'd kiff that counts but. A friend once told he for sure doesn't want to have kids. Next sentence he talks about how clever he is because he can use a condom two times. He just rolls it on the other side and he is ready to go again. I literally died laughing on the floor because he was dead serious and couldn't see the mistake, 100.
If gas prices are too high for you just buy an electric car a friend of a friend. Mosquitoes do not live or reproduce in stagnant water. The same person who said this also visited a swamp and a closed mini lake with clouds of mosquitoes, and complained about the quantity and aggressiveness of said mosquitoes. Is working really only about earning a paycheck? Why don't you ask your parents to buy a house for you to live in while you're in school? Said to my son. I was complaining about the lack of accessibility in a bar I went to a few times I'm a wheelchair user to a friend and he would just dismiss it with oh it's just three steps, what's the harm? I just don't want to be bothering people with help for just three steps and do things on my own. Able-bodied people don't really realize how easy they have it. A couple years ago Chris Pronger made a Twitter account and went on an epistle about how NHL players don't actually make that much money after spending on luxury cars multiple houses, fashion etc. It was about as tone deaf as you can get. It will be easy because we will have a newborn. Reality is about to hit them right in the face. Here on Reddit some woman said her partner got angry at her for getting her period on their vacation because he was planning on having a lot of sex and she ruined it because she decided not to hold it. See level at my job commenting on the old truck I drive why do you drive around in that old junk? Never mind that it's paid for, paid for itself 10x over and still going just fine. Rent is so expensive. You should buy a triplex and rent the other units out instead. Mom triplexes cost about a million. How on earth am I supposed to get approval for that if rent is an issue for me?